YouTube, what's going on guys? Hey, uh, today um, just wanted to do some more reviews for you. Um, the holidays are here. Uh, during this time, you know, it's, 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 it's component and gear time, man. It's time to rack up on these sales and get good deals on components and gear. This is the time where we need to rack up. So I highly advise everyone to go out there, check out every website that sells bike products on these Black Friday sales, see what you can find for cheap. Um, I'll put the description in the video below on the items that I'm going to actually show to show you guys today. Now, if you check my other videos, you will see that I did a review on some arm pads, the POC um, air uh, elbow guards, not arm pads. What am I talking about? Uh, elbow guards and today I wanted to do another review on a different type of pair of a different brand because I needed to find something cheaper the POCs are expensive man I think I paid like a hundred bucks for those things and so I'm not going to be spending you know multiple hundreds of dollars on elbow pads or knee pads and all of that so um, I needed to find some cheaper ones out there for uh, a couple of things one just to have a different uh, a different pair because uh, I don't want to keep using the same ones each time and then I need to take another pair to North Carolina so when I ride up there with my mountain bike at home um, I'll have a pair up there so I went with the Liet's these are the Liet 3DF 5.0 elbow guards and so this is what they pretty much look like um, I like the colorway honestly I like blue and orange that's that's one of cool colorway um, orange is one of my favorite colors so um, I think the design is pretty cool and I also got the lime green one as well or the electric green um, this is a size large but I think I'm gonna have to end up taking this one back and exchanging it for a size medium because um, it feels a little big but what I'm worried about is I'm probably gonna get the medium and the medium is gonna be too small I, I guarantee you that's what's gonna happen so um, I might end up keeping these, but I'm just going to show you the fit and feel of it. First off, the back is open and ventilated. So you have all of this room for air coming in. And this is a very thin mesh material, even though it's elastic on it and it grips very well. Um, it's it's going to hold it in place and you're going to get a lot of air in here. So your arm or elbow is not going to be hot at all. Um, it has on this. Uh, little graphic moisture cool wicking fabric and uh, kind of like a dry fit I guess you could say it also has the uh, grip on the elastic when it goes on the upper arm so this is for the right side so I'm just going to show you the look and feel and fit of this uh, arm guard elbow pad elbow guard whatever you want to call it um, so as you can see and I'll kind of put the camera down already you're going to have this opening In this upper arm area so this is going to kind of go up pretty far on the upper arm got to just tuck in the little piece of paper I hate those things but and actually I might keep this large man because it really does feel comfortable and so it's not really but then again I don't know it's hard to really tell because I just don't have the medium to compare it to and that's the thing because I could get the medium and it'd be too tight and then I'm ordering the large again and that's like a lot of money in returns and continuing to ship back and forth so I might just order another medium now and, and just order it by itself and just see how it feels but anyway so this padding is thicker it is thicker and it's a lot more cushioned than the than the POCs that I have but um, but it's it's comfortable it's not too to me it doesn't feel bulky doesn't feel big um, this is not it doesn't feel like it's it's gonna slip to be honest with you it really doesn't even if my arm was sweaty it just doesn't feel like this is gonna move around a lot um, so I think I paid for both of them well of course the whole the set the left and the right side I think I paid um, I think I paid $35 for these which I think, hold on, let me pull up the retail price real quick for you guys because I don't want to tell you any wrong information. Um, I 
This is the lid. Yeah. So these. Wait a minute. Oh yeah, I only paid twenty bucks for these things. Yeah, I paid twenty dollars for these, and these were normally sixty bucks. Um, it's a Black Friday sale that they're doing on. I think this is pronounced CambriaBike.com. Now I've ordered things from them before, and I've never had a problem with them. So right now I'll put a link to the description. They have both of these colorways in all sizes: small, all the way, small, medium, large, extra large, and a two X. So no matter what your size, to get these things for 20 bucks, I think you can't beat it. Um, and these were like just a spare to have, you know, just a spare, a spare to have, to change it up a little bit. Um, and if I have like someone else coming to ride over, I'll have an extra pair for them. Or if, you know, I take these home, like that's the original plan. So just wanted to let you know how these fit. I'm gonna put on the left one as well, just so you guys can see it from both sides. Uh. So you want the elbow, and it kind of has the, the, the form, like your elbow will kind of slide in the pocket where it's supposed to go. So it's not easy, I mean, it's not hard to, to miss where your elbow is supposed to be. And then that's it, and it has a little bit more protection on the sides. I really think I could have went with the medium though, now that I have both on my hands, I mean both on my arms. So um, I may switch it up and do that. And I hope this guy, I hope you guys can kind of see it pretty well, but, um, yeah, that's that's pretty much what I think I'm going to plan on doing is getting these in a medium. I think it'll just fit a little bit better. The only thing that I'm worried about is this piece. Now, you can see this elastic is tight on my arm, right? You can see the indenture of how my arm fat is going around the actual um, elastic park right here. So what I'm worried about is the medium size, if it's already doing this on the large, I got a feeling the medium is going to probably be super tight on that section, but I think this part of it will um, actually help to be a little bit smaller. Now it does have a uh, sizing chart on the actual packaging, and this packaging is really nice, um, but it says that a small in inches is 7.8 through 9.4, a medium would be 7.8 inches through 11 inches. So wait a minute, that doesn't make sense. And then a large is from 11 inches to 12.5. An extra large is 12.5 to 14.1. And an extra, extra large is 14.1 through 15.7. And then they have junior sizes, which is 7.4 through 8.2 inches. So that's kind of weird. The small is 7.8 through 9.4 but then the medium is 7.8 through 11 inches. So it's almost, it doesn't seem like the medium is that much bigger than the small, which now makes it, makes me wonder if yeah, I need to stick with the large, if that's the case, because now I could be jumping into almost a small category. Um, the large is 11 inches um, by, I mean through 12 and a half inches. And this says, um, this is the arm circumference. So I'm assuming they're, basically um, wanting you to do the circumference of your actual bicep um, is usually how that works. So uh, I may just go and get an actual tape measure myself. So basically the circumference normally if you're measuring that would be like your bicep area, kind of like where the stitching is right here is where I measure it. So I'll probably do that after this video, then that way I can actually see my exact size. So again, just in case you guys are interested in buying some of these, and the price is probably gonna go back up at the Black Friday. So uh, I'll just put it up here for you guys to see if you wanna pause it. Hopefully that comes up on the camera. If not, I'll back it up a little bit for you. And again, this is um, the 3DF 5.0 Elbow Guards. This is size large that I got, but um, after I measure, I may go with the medium. So we shall see. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh, um, I got some more reviews coming up because hey, it's actually cold in Florida right now. And so, uh, you know, I can't ride. So, I mean, not at the moment. Um, so uh, yeah, I just do some, some reviews on some products. I uh, want to shout out my school, man, Blankner, Blankner K8 uh, school in Orlando, Florida. I'm representing them tonight on the shirt. And so um, shout out to everyone out there. 
uh, Dr. Crow, the principal, uh, Mr. Bing, the AP. Um, that's one of my schools that I help support. So anyway, other than that, guys, see you on the next video. Take care. Be safe. Peace.